YouTube and welcome to another YouTube video. Welcome to my road to my photo shoot. So as you all know, I'm using this YouTube channel because it's helping me keep myself accountable for it at the same time. So if you like what you see, make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell button down there because you're going to be notified every time I post up. As you know, I did a 90 day transformation and I did document that on my YouTube channel as well. I'm going to leave the uh, link for you underneath in the description box so you can go and have a look because it helps me get all the way down from 90 91 kgs all the way down to the 71 mark there is my progress photos which I did for that then I told my coach I want to go a little bit further okay I'm 44 years old nearly I want to actually experience and do a photo shoot and I want to show people that it can still be done at even at this age you can still get your results you can still get your ideal dreams if you really really want to go for it okay so that's why i'm using the youtube channel obviously because i want to document it at the same time so then i've always got something that i can also look back on at the same time so i checked myself out in the mirror this morning i'm going to put it out for you just up there that is me this morning I'm looking really really good i've showed my coach as well you can actually see the abs are really starting to pop out now and i'm really getting leaner and leaner slowly i've got about seven to eight weeks to go roughly before I go and do a photo shoot so I still got plenty of time um, but obviously we're gonna just keep it going and I'm gonna give you some tips in this video okay how to even get started how to actually create a couple of healthy habits I'm gonna just gonna throw out some tips for you in this video so many people go so wrong when they do their fitness journey because they go in super super hard super super quick and they burn out super super quick okay all you've got to do is seriously just keep it very very simple okay so I'm just gonna give you a couple of simple tips right now the first thing you need to do is go on to your tdde calculators and you need to calculate your maintenance okay as soon as you've calculated your maintenance then all you've got to do is start tracking your maintenance just track what it says track what you're doing use my fitness pal you can use a new track there's a carb manager out there there's so many apps out there and they're free as well yes there is a paid version but guess what you don't need the paid version because the free version does exactly the same thing I hear so many excuses all the time, but I don't want to track my food. But in the, the day, how long are you scrolling through your Instagram? How long are you scrolling through your TikToks? How long are you scrolling through your Facebooks? Honestly, tracking your food takes absolute seconds. And not only that, it logs it all in for you as well. So we don't have to track it all the time. You can just go in, find it, what you're looking for, ping the button, boom, done. So right, once you've got used to tracking in your maintenance, then all you've got to do is just slowly drop the calories down by 50 calories to 100 calories. Don't go super, super high with it if you're not used to it. Okay, just go nice and slow with it all the way down. And then you just got to keep tracking it, okay, along the periods of time, okay? So you've got to, you've got to track if you're going to do a lean bulk obviously i'm going to do a lean bulk after i've done this photo shoot anyway so i'm going to show you how to do it so you track in the lean bulk you track on a maintenance if you want to track on a maintenance just to maintain it to do a re-body composition and you can also also need to be tracking if you're in a calorie deficit another really really good tip which has helped me absolute loads is just make sure you're drinking at least two to three liters of water Okay, now if you don't like plain water, which is absolutely fine, I've got clients that don't like plain water. Okay, there is some low calorie juices you can get. Obviously, don't go pouring the whole bottle inside it just to sweeten it up. Just put a little bit in just to water it down a little bit so it just takes the flavor away of the water. And then you've got a little bit of a flavor that you can have at the same time. And here comes another really, really good tip. You, I say this all the time, but it's so easy to do. All you gotta do is get at least 10,000 steps in a day. If you're having trouble with the 10,000, start with a five, build it up, get it to about 10,000 steps a day. Obviously, the more steps you can do, the more weight you're gonna lose as well when you're stuck inside that deficit. Best thing is you don't even need a gym membership either, because guess what? Walking is absolutely free of charge. So you're about to give me the excuse that it's raining outside and you can't get your steps in. I've got a solution, don't worry. Here you go. Now there's no excuse. You can get your steps in quite happily at home with all these walking workouts. There's so many on YouTube. There's absolutely loads to pick from. You've got 5,000 steps. You've got 2,000 steps. You've got 1,500 steps. Whichever one you want to do. And you can even do some strength training as well with your step training on top of that. So there is really no excuse just to get those steps in. Because I really ain't joking. I've heard every excuse in the book. Okay, there's always an excuse. But do not worry. There's always a 
solution to the excuses. Right, I'm going to go and run a very, very quick Zoom session and see how many people jump on that one for me today. And then we're going to come back. I'm going to give you some more tips. Five, four, three, two, one. So Zoom session's all finished. I'm just going to go for a walk now through this very spooky wood. Look at that, look at that, look at that. I know absolutely stupid or absolutely crazy, I don't know, but I'm going to go for a walk through here while I give you some more tips. So you need to be going for the higher protein options. Now, what do I mean by that? Like, what I mean by the higher protein options is you need to be going for the lean chicken. You need to be going for the lean mince, the lean turkey. You've got the white fish. Also need to be putting together some low calorie dense meals okay so what does this mean it basically means that you're going to have less calories but you're going to have more calories in your bowl if you know what i mean so basically what we're going to do is i'm going to show you how you're going to do that in another video because it's going to take too long in this one and i don't want this video dragging out okay so that one will go into a different one how to literally put together some low calorie dense meals serious note it does not have to be technical it doesn't have to be complicated weight loss is really really simple people literally will just over complicate it and make it so much harder for themselves which then makes them literally burn out and they just go so wrong on their fitness journeys it's so easy to do if you don't know how to do it hire yourself a coach there's coaches out there that will help you they will you, all you got to do is speak to one of them reach out to them yes i know some coaches cost an arm and a leg but if you can't afford a coach there is some um, YouTube videos you can actually follow along with as well. I hired myself a coach just so that I could one keep myself accountable and two I wanted to do something which I knew I couldn't do by myself and I needed that a little bit of an extra push to actually get it done so this is why I've gone to a coach and this is why I'm putting everything up onto my YouTube channel because then I can document it at the same time. And there you go some really simple tips in there which I've used to help myself because that's what my coach has given me because yes, I have got myself a coach, as you all know, but I use that coach because he helps me keep myself accountable. And not only that, I'm training other clients as well. So then I can help keep them accountable. And then I've always got somebody on my side as well, which is not only that, I'm actually learning so much off of him as well. There's stuff that I didn't even actually know myself, which I am now learning. So I'm just literally soaking up every single bit of knowledge that he has given me. I'm soaking it up. And what I'm doing is I'm passing it on to my clients. Now, my, I've got a couple of clients that I'm working with at the moment from my boot camps and I've got to say they are doing really really well one of them is literally just coming into her first stone loss one of them is already two and a half stone down as well and I have another lady that is literally well she's literally destroyed it and actually just gone for it I mean now she's literally exactly where she wants to be and now we're just working on the maintenance now for her I'm gonna close this video off just here okay so remember if you want to see any more footage like this make sure you like subscribe hit the bell button down there because you're gonna be notified every time I post up a video okay so until then i'll see you lot in the next one